Hi Stan, this is Jimmy over at Lakeshore RV. Thank you and congratulations on your 2022 Passport 2870 rear living. Up front you got your power tongue jack with your docking lights on. You got your extend and your return. 220 pound propane tanks. Your battery here with your battery disconnect there. <clears throat> if you did want to add another solar, solar panel, which you know being out in California you guys get a lot of sun. You do have an extra solar charge there, so you can upgrade this to 400 without having to set up another one on top. Here you got Keystone's cluster, you got your satellite TV, your power extend uh, power jacks, your shower, fresh water connection, and your city water connection, your solar charge controller here. You also got your, your manual jacks just in case the power goes out or if your campground does run out of power. Your hot water heater here. Just know that it's controlled by a couple buttons on the inside, and I'll show you those when we go in. You got your 50 pound, or 50 pound, you got your 50 amp service here, which it is prepped for a second AC. You got your ladder. Make sure you get on top at least twice a year to make sure it's caulked up and no water can get in. Spare tire in the back. Down here, this is where you're gonna put your sewer hose for storage. And this one does have the double awnings on it as well. You got the one here and the one over the doorway. And I saw the steps to get up inside. Nice big area with a really decent sized island. Nice little area to put your coffee. A 12 volt fridge. Got a little microwave up over there. Your three burner stove with a splash pad. All you do is you just push it in and you turn it until it sparks. The propane just has to get through it. There you go. Got your light and your fan. Big storage in here. Plenty of pantry space. Nice little entertainment area. Got a nice 40 inch TV. You got your Bluetooth, which has an outside and inside speakers, and then your nice fire. And this does get pretty warm, so if you just need it to warm up the space out here, you, it'll have no issue doing that. Got a nice trifold couch here, better than the jackknife. Get a little bit more space, plus it's just more, more comfortable. Then here, you just got your theater seats. Just pull that. Then you get the full extension, and it does go back pretty far. And then you also got your table and your chairs. Your fuse box is here, so if anything does go wrong, you should just be able to pop this open. One of the sides. I'm just pushing it back into place at this point. Nice size bathroom. Big. Skylight over the shower. You got plenty of space for your towels, your washcloths, everything like that. And a medicine cabinet. And this was that cluster I was talking about for that water pump. So you can use gas or electric. And then this is how you turn it on. You got your porch lights and your ceiling lights back here. And then this is just your light switch for down below. Thermostat. Pretty easy, you just hit mode, fan, AC, heat, and off. And then just your, your bedroom, you do have a nice closet back here. Pretty big size for one of these size trailers. Plenty of storage on the sides here too. And up above you can put books and everything like that. And you got your two 110 volts and USBs. Residential queen size bed, so it's a little bit longer. It's as long as a king, just not as wide. And then storage underneath. All right, and that is pretty much it. When you get here, there is a, a weight distribution hitch that hasn't been made up for your, for your truck yet, but that'll get installed once you get here and we'll show you how to do it, but again, Thank you and congratulations. Thank you for allowing me to earn your business and I'll see you tomorrow, Stan. Have a good one.